Everyone has an M&S favorite, but there are always new products being launched. So some very special guests are going to try them. Say hello to what's new at M&S. Hello. <laughs> hello. Welcome to Hi. M&S Food. I have this envelope for you. Thank you very much. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Like yes, hunt. come on. Right, welcome to M&S Food. Today you're going to be amongst the first to try our new Italian range inspired by classic dishes and ingredients from all over Italy. We hope you love them all, but we'd each like you to choose your favourite. Wow. That's going to be hard. Italian food is one of my favourites. I love it. I what's, what's your favourite Italian food? Pasta. Pesto. Pasta. Pesto pasto, basically. You didn't what? say anything. Pizza. Pizza. <laughs> 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 hats, we call them in our own. <laughs> Pasta hats. Enjoy your meal. Thank you very much. How do you pronounce that again? Pea and mint. Girasole. 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 That's going it's straight actually, in. It's quite strong, that parmesan. It is. It's so good. That's a mature parmesan. That's gorgeous. Are you all right, Pat? it? Too strong for you? Are you, you going to do that moment from when Harry met Sally? That should be illegal. Because <laughs> that is ridiculous. It's good, ridiculous. Isn't it? What are we saying about the scallop linguine, Pad? That's delicious. I'm, I'm all over this parmesan one at the oh, minute. It's so I'm good. Like... This is my favorite. This will work in my house because oh, I'm veggie and the kids will eat that. See, mine love Percy pigs. <laughs> you can't put that on pasta. You can in our house. <laughs> <laughs> I must take you to Bolton one day. That actually would make a really nice starter. You could buy like one of those and do it oh. as a little starter. Yeah, couldn't yes. You? What's in this one? Chicken. That is chicken pea and pancetta risotto. The one that we all struggle to pronounce is delicious. The pea and mint. Oh, can you taste the mint? I can only taste pea, but I love that. A little bit of mint. What about the food? <laughs> right. I'm going to taste the pea, and will you know? Yeah. I'm getting the pea. Oh, well, I can taste the mint. I, like I can the taste pea. the mint. Can you? Oh, I've got a mint. The mint's in there. I'm going in again. That's really sweet. What a treat. Pasta is just like really my sweet. favourite food. Mm. I'm moving in. I'm moving into the kitchen. Oh, that was really good. You've I done know. good. So You've good. done very good. You've done ever so well. You smell oh, gorgeous. Or is that Enjoy. Thank, Thank you. you. Oh, oh King my. Prawn. I, I don't know if this is right in my accent. Bucatini. What's that? Bucatini. Hello. Hello. Hi, I'm John, development chef for uh, MS Food. Hi, I was uh, lucky enough to work on all the recipes for this. So oh, my God. Here to wow. talk to you. Are you got any questions? for the pa Parmesan? We are indeed. We, yes. have so that. Good. we love that. Do you know why that's so special? We, we, we roll our pasta really, really, really thin. So you get loads of filling, silky smooth, and you don't even need really any sauce. Just a little bit of olive oil, oh. butter, and that's it. I could eat a plate of that, like you say. Nothing else, yeah. just a plate yeah. of that. Yeah. And that's quite it's quite a mature parmesan in there, I thought. You know, we, we, no, went on a, we went on a research trip to Rome and they have a dish there called cacio oh, I, love that. I love that job. <laughs> yeah. I mean, research. Yeah. I mean, it's, uh, research I mean, it's a hard trips, life. Yeah. <laughs> bowls and bowls of pasta and risotto. But, uh, yes. Yeah, it was, it was amazing. And we kind of, we see this dish, cacio e pepe, uh, pecorino romano and pepper and pasta. A little bit of water in there. And we wanted to bring that back into a, to a, to a dish that all of our customers would it's enjoy. It's so simple. And that's it. Yes. And it's just bags of flavour, silky pasta, loads of delicious filling. Yes. Let me tell you about this, this beef, right? We, we cook this beef long and slow in a sous vide bag. So this is what top restaurants do. We cook it long and slow, top river beef, meltingly tender. Like, you, you oh. can't get better than that in a restaurant. That is absolutely fantastic. Right, That's my favourite product. Pads, come Send on. it down. See, this is... I feel like this that's is, really like my hubby would love that. This like, is why yeah, I'm here, you see. Yeah. This is why I'm here, because David Gandhi... Oh, yeah. He wouldn't eat that. He, and, it, and to be honest, he's been taking my work for the last 10 years. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's about time I got my own back. It's true. I'm Going having really all well. the carbs and all the beef, let me tell you. And that's and that's the best way to get the meat to just melt, is, is long that? and slow. Long and slow. Wow. It's so good. Is it? 
Wow. Like, it's like the fanciest version of, like, spaghetti bolognese in my <laughs> yeah. life. That's it. Like, this is how I cook, though. I just do this. <laughs> Ding! That's me. Like, can I ask a question? I'm not so keen on walnuts. Mm. No, but I know what you mean. Now, if I saw that, that wouldn't be one I would, I'd be immediately drawn to. But when you're eating it, Oh, it's, it's the just texture. Interest, it's just a texture mm, thing. Yeah. It's that little bit of crumb. You can't really I taste it, it, but it's a nice crumb. Do you know what I like? That's a little surprise. It so is indeed, good. isn't it? That it's is a surprise, Paddy, well. unless you read the label. Oh. Look at that. <laughs> this risotto here, again, mm. we, we had this experience of this lovely free flowing risotto. Mm. And we wanted, oh. we wanted to translate to a, a customer experience. So, what we developed was this amazing little drop of flavour on the top. It's mascarpone, butter, parmesan. Mm. So, as you kind of just cook that, it. you get mm. to ca take that experience the aromas, the roasted oh. mushroom, the porcini. You yeah. stir that all through, you get that experience. That is really sturdy. That's what sturdy. we wanted to get over. Because mm. a lot of vegetarian Sugar. food, uh, lacks flavour yeah. and lacks kind of texture mm -hmm. and that's really, oh, yes. I'm going to say almost meaty. Look at that. So nice. The thing for me here, John, with, with, with that's tasting really these meals today, mm. a being a lad from Bolton, yeah, there's certain big. things on here, if I was in Marks and Spencer, I'd look and I'd probably think, yeah, I'll be all right, but I'd, yeah. I'd go beef for a goo because yeah. that's what I'm used to and stuff like that. But things like this gorgonzola and walnut, is amazing. That permit, you know, it's things now I'm trying, I'm like, yeah. wow. You wouldn't necessarily yeah. go for that. Exactly. We, we look at the, the best restaurants around the world and, and want to bring that back to our customers. We want to show off how amazing the food is. It's oh. the amount of care that goes into every single the ingredient is stunning. And that was amazing. That's what you could taste in the And that's that was it, your, and it gives that, you that, richness, that, that, seasoning. That was my favourite, but now I'm like, I am. Um, I'm gonna say it's been pretty good because the beef sauce so is a treat. I've never yeah. tasted it like that in my life. You've made this really difficult now because with the first I round, I kind of felt like I was definitely drawn to one of mm, them. Same. Now you've added all of these, <laughs> and all five of them That's good. are incredible. Mm -hmm. And I don't know, I don't know how you pick your favourite out. Of that. that was going to go through to the next round for me, but <laughs> no. now I don't. I can't choose between those. Good. I, think. So we have I love that Amanda's one. talking like oh, going no. through to the next round like she's That's on BGT. <laughs> yeah. I'm impressed with the red button <laughs> next. Maybe it's a boot camp. Bang. Yeah, I know. Bang. John, get What's out of here. What's your dream? <laughs> right, so my top three mm. would be the, the ragu, mm. the parmesan, oh, top four actually, the scallop <laughs> or the basil. <laughs> One, mm. the pesto one. Basically, Ross, well, you want it all, don't you? Yeah. I really enjoyed well, it. Well, I'm, I'm with you on the first two, so I'm going to go ragu, that parmesan, which seems to be popular with all of yeah. us. Yeah. And I'd probably go the scallop and pancetta linguine. Yeah, see? Amanda, you've got the one that I think we'd all have picked, which is the parmesan ravioli. Parmesan. Yeah. It's that all the way because I know my husband, my kids, yeah. everyone. I can do that for everyone rather than everyone. make three different Absolutely. meals. See, that's the thing that, that, that I keep thinking about is yeah. I want a meal that I'm not going to yes. have any moaning about. Yes. Yes. Yeah, but it's yeah. got peppers in there. Yeah. It's got yeah. green yeah. bits. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm going to yeah. go pesto. Yeah. Kids love it. Yeah. Yeah. We love it. It takes me back Same. to when I used to be kid free and I'd have a night out and I'd get in and Lovely. I'd just chuck a bowl of pasta on and a oh. packet of pesto yeah. in and you just have a little oh, nibble at midnight and can we all just out. yeah That's can we all just take a just moment to remember yeah. when we were kid free that sounded good do one of those that was oh, yeah. oh, <laughs> remember oh. the days remember the and days and I think maybe I <laughs> cook lines. pesto quite a lot for them so that I just reminisce just for a little yeah. while while I'm at that table mm. <laughs> cleaning up chins this is my win at the scallop and pancetta and and pea linguine. Mm. I like the spice. I've gone for the beef but ragu. you took it. it. It's a crowd pleaser. Yeah, I the beef was very, very tender, which pleased me. And again, <laughs> that's one of the things with uh, m and Because you are tender. tender yeah. Beefy. <laughs> Beefy. <laughs> <laughs> very meaty. Yeah. Beefy man, but, but you're tender. very tender. Very yeah, tender. that's it. Yeah. We like that. Yeah. Mm. Could you oh, imagine yeah. if suddenly that the, the m and food advert with that beautiful voice suddenly yeah. changed to... Well, we've all picked four belting dishes yeah. Yeah. regardless. I'm happy with that. I mean, it's hard to pick though, to be honest. <laughs>